Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to walk you through the steps on how you can remove music apps that you're not using in your Tesla vehicle. So this is going to clean things up in our menu area in here. A lot of these apps are music apps. So if we get rid of them, then it's going to clean up this area. But also when we're searching for music, it shows us search results for all the different music apps. So if you remove some of these apps, it's going to clean up the search experience. So I'm going to get rid of all of the music apps that I don't use. To do this, no matter which music app that you're in, you're going to have this little option up here with the icon that looks like a little play with three horizontal lines we're going to click on that that opens us up to this menu and we want to find where it says settings and click on that and in our audio settings we want to find sources and uncheck every single option that you're not using so i'm not using streaming karaoke tune in title apple music spotify apple podcast audible amazon music and I'm gonna leave it with YouTube Music and of course keeping the Bluetooth option. So now when we exit out of this, and if I open up my apps menu down here by clicking on those three horizontal dots, you can see all of that clutter, all of those extra apps that I wasn't using no longer show up in this area, so that's pretty nice. But also when we search for music, when I search for a particular song or artist or whatever I want to listen to, it's only gonna show me results now for the apps that I had selected. So it's just showing me the YouTube Music options in this area this can actually be pretty confusing if you don't go through this process because you might search for artists or music and then it'll show you search results for different music apps that you don't even use and then you have to scroll through this page to try to find the music app that you use for what you searched for this streamlines the whole process and makes it a lot more intuitive and i definitely recommend doing this eliminating all of the different music apps that you're not using in your tesla to make this a little bit better of an experience so again just a quick refresh we're going to click on this little icon here that has the play button with the three horizontal lines then we're going to find where it says settings then we're going to open up our sources and we're going to uncheck all of the music apps that you're not using. So if you're just using Spotify, just have that one toggled on and then uncheck all the rest or whichever music app you're using. That's the one that you want to have toggled to the on position like I have with YouTube Music. So I hope this quick tutorial was helpful going through how you can get rid of the music apps that you're not using in your Tesla. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing to the YouTube channel and I'll see you back here next time.